Hello Lawrence, uh, I hope you're feeling great and not too confused by now. Anyways, it seems like that you're a little confused as to how to handle your main domain name and your add-on domain name. So the e easiest way to illustrate that is, uh, and I'll do this video, is to utilize uh, FileZilla. So we'll, I'm going to log into your account. And of course, you want to look in, double click on public HTML. So, public HTML is actually a folder, this yellow folder, which is your main domain name, the wealth mine. Within that folder, you have your other folder. Uh, your my free web space which is your add-on domain so in this lower box or lower window yeah as you can see you have your images file and if you go down you have your index.html file you must have removed your your um, <clears throat> PDF ebook. Anyways, um, I'm not sure if you have your index HTML file uh, copy on your desktop. If you do, fine. All you have to do is right click and click on delete. If you don't, uh, do the same thing. Just right click and you can download this file which will download it to your, your desktop and you'll have to find some your folder or your desktop location where you want to have it downloaded to okay, once you do that then you can come in here right click and delete that in index file okay now you say you want to upload your squeeze page into uh, your my free web space no my free web page so to do that you have to double click into this folder see right now everything in this window upgraded or uploaded from your computer will go into this window right here which is your public HTML or your main domain name. So to get into your uh, add-on domain you have to double click on that and then you have this information here. That's why right now when you enter your add-on domain name, my free web page, into um, a browser window <clears throat> all you see is an index of uh, CGI bin. Okay, so once you get to this level, then you find your your uh, index.html file on your desktop or where, wherever you have it, whether you have it in um, your documents or desktop, and just double click on it, or you can uh, right click and click on upload, and it'll just Upload it into this window right here. Okay? Hope that makes sense.